Welcome back to the channel everybody, this is Codations, and in today's video, we're jumping back into some Cookie Run Kingdom, and we are actually going to be jumping into some Cookie Run Oven Break, that's right, officially, the developers have made a collaboration event between their two star games, alright, so without further ado, let's dive right in. Diving right in, ladies and gentlemen. So like I said, we're going to be discussing that brand new collaboration event that they dropped. And it's going to be talking about Cookie Run Oven Break and then Cookie Run Kingdom. Man, if you guys don't already know, but Cookie Run Kingdom actually gets most of the cookies and everything in the story and lore and everything based on the Cookie Run Oven Break series, which was a game prior to Cookie Run Kingdom even coming out. All right. So just keep that in mind. They are two different games. Not only that, Cookie Run Oven Break is a completely different play style um, than playing playing Cookie Kingdom, all right? So just keep that in mind. But nevertheless, the event basically says Cookie Run Kingdom Oven Break Season Update is officially here. And then it says play Cookie Run Oven Break and get a decoration set in Cookie Run Kingdom. And not only that, we're going to get a handful of crystals and for a total of 2,000, um, 1,000, so it's going to be three, five, um, a total of 4,000 crystals is what we're going to get from this specific event. Now, you guys ask me all the time, what is the best way to get crystals and how can you get Get more crystals code please help me out i need more crystals hey code what is the secret to crystals how can i get more crystals guess what events events like this one right here easy peasy to do you download their other game you log in you link your account you play through a little bit of the campaign or the story whatever it is um, for the game guess what boom you get some free crystals all right so basically what it says here is pretty much we've got to download their other game cookie run oven break which up until this point i have not done so i have not played it whatsoever so I'm actually kind of excited to jump into the game um, to really check it out and see what it's all about. I know there's some big content creators on the YouTube platform that do cover Cookie Run Oven Break already. So, hey, we might have to check it out for ourselves. But nevertheless, we've got Mission 1 is going to be link your account um, via the dev play option. All right. So we'll dive into that in a second. I'll show you exactly how to do that. But the next thing up we've got is going to be Mission 2, clear stage 1 through 9 in the main story. Again, this is in the other game. This is not Kingdom. This is in the Cookie Run Oven Break break game keep that in mind we got a clear stage one one nine then mission three is going to be clear stage two seven in the main story um and basically for a total of it looks to be what six seven new decorations that we get to take advantage of in kingdom which look really cool i'm excited about one of them is going to be a beach theme right here in the center very nice and then not only that we are going to get a total of four thousand crystals all right so again we got to download cookie run oven break which you've already have done and then not only that we've got to link the two accounts and again, I will show you that right here on screen, but it basically says, please ensure that Cookie Run Kingdom or Cookie Run Kingdom and Cookie Run Oven Break um, both are linked to the same exact dev play account in order to receive the rewards. And then it says you can find each of the rewards in your Cookie Run Kingdom's mailbox. And then it also says, Delivery can take up to one hour for them to show up, all right? So just keep that in mind. If you don't get them right away, especially like the first one, just for a link in your dev play account, it can take up to one hour, all right? So keep that in mind. And then basically it also says event rewards can only be claimed once per account, all right? So very cool, very cool, all right. So here's the thing. I got the game downloaded. Let's jump into some Cookie Run Oven Break for the very first time and then show you kind of what you're looking for or how to link the two accounts, all right? So once you get logged in to the Cookie Run Oven Break game, you got it downloaded, you get loaded in, you might have to play a little bit through the tutorial. If you don't want to play the, th um, the, the, the tutorial, you can actually hit the skip button up here in the cog wheel. Um, you click that basically when it starts off, you can hit the skip tutorial button and it should bring you to this screen here, all right? Now, once you're officially here on the screen, you're going to go ahead and click on that settings icon and then right here at the very, very top where it says dev play login, Right here is going to be where you need to click in order to link it, all right? Now, again, we'll jump back into some Cookie Run Kingdom here really quick for you guys. Again, if you guys don't know where to get your dev play account, you're going to click here on the tabs. You're going to go to the settings option, and then you're going to go to the info section. Now, I have blurred mine out, but whatever is placed right here um, for you in Cookie Run Kingdom, that is going to be the same account that you need to be logged into on your Cookie Run Oven Break, all right? So if we hop back over here to Cookie Run Oven Break, as you can see, 
you're going to click on this button. Now, when you click on this button to connect, you know, your dev play count, um, mine says information because I've already connected it. But anyways, once you click on that, then it's going to give you the option to connect via, you know, just dev play email address and password if that's what you did before. Otherwise, if you used your Facebook, connect through Facebook. If you used your Google, connect to Google, your iCloud account, if you're using Apple, whatever it is that you use to connect to it, that's what you need to be making sure that they are linked together. Once you connect them, boom, bada, bing, you should be able to um, see that this information changes. And then not only that, um, once you actually click on this information here, you will have two tabs up here at the top. Again, I have um, blurred everything on mine out. But anyways, once you have su successfully linked your two accounts, you go to the game section. And then as long as you can see both of the games listed here um, underneath your games, specifically on your dev play account, then that will verify that you have successfully linked both of them. All right. So that's pretty much all I've got for you guys today. Nothing too crazy. We did an awesome live stream summoning session last night. If you didn't check it out, you should definitely go check it out because we got a ton of really good summons and we were super happy with what we got, not only in the cookie gotcha, but also in the treasure gotcha. I'm super excited um, for this official collaboration because this entire time I just couldn't be bothered to play cookie run oven break. But now I officially have a reason to because as a collector and playing cookie run kingdom, I want those 4,000 additional crystals, man. So we're definitely going to hop in here, play this out at least to complete all three of those missions to get those crystals and rewards. We'll probably do a video or two on it talking about how exactly to do it. But with that being said, ladies and gentlemen, as always, you guys let me know down below in the comments what you guys think. Are you already playing Cookie Run Oven Break? Is it something that you would like to see more content from me on and playing? Then I'll definitely have to check it out. But with that being said, ladies and gentlemen, as always, please be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Hit the notification bell so you get notification every time we drop a video. And I will see you guys on the next one.